Hey guys, what's going on? Sean Ross here. Welcome to this video. In this video, we're going to talk about paid traffic sources, but one specific paid traffic source that not many people are using and it is so effective and cheap at the same time because not many affiliate marketers are actually using that paid traffic source. That it's just a gold mine of sales. If you're brand new to internet marketing, if you're brand new to affiliate marketing, this paid traffic source can really change everything all right so in this video I'm gonna talk about it and I'm gonna show you some examples too so you see exactly how you can set up your ads and make money from it all right so first what is this paid traffic source I you know if you know me if you follow me on YouTube if you're a subscriber uh, by the way if you're not make sure to subscribe all right I make videos every single day so if you're not a sub, uh, if you sub, if you sub, are a subscriber you know that I talk about paid traffic sources all the time because paid traffic is the best way to just get sales as an affiliate marketer and just make a lot of money okay you don't want to rely on free traffic because it takes time and it's just not as effective as paid traffic and it's not controllable you know you cannot control it you cannot control you cannot control the flow of the traffic you know what if you want to you're making money you want to make more sales you, you know if you if you're doing paid traffic you can just increase your budget but you can't do that with free traffic right so um, that's why I love um, paid traffic. Now, when it comes to paid traffic, we got our usual suspects, you know, Google advertising, YouTube advertising, Facebook, Bing, you know, all that stuff that we all know. But there's one traffic source that it's weird that not many affiliate marketers are using it. And it's just so powerful, so powerful. That if you put it in work correctly, you can make a lot of money from it. And you, you almost have no competition, okay? And that traffic source, is Twitter all right so in this video I'm gonna talk about Twitter ads I'm gonna take you to my computer I'm gonna show you some examples you know I'm gonna explain you know some I'm showing, gonna show you some of my own results with Twitter and then uh, I'm gonna set up an ad in front of you so you see exactly how it's done it's not that complicated and the thing is you know Twitter is like hundred times easier than Google advertising YouTube advertising they're the same thing um, you know Bing advertising that's PPC same as Google but um, you know like or Facebook advertising Facebook is a little bit more complicated than anything else but you know Twitter is super simple it's almost like setting up a just putting out a tweet you know it's super easy uh, so yeah so in this video we're gonna talk about Twitter advertising it's effective it's super cheap and it's the best way one of the best ways you know there are a lot of different good ways to make money online but one of the best ways to get traffic to your fleet offer especially if you're brand new and you know you don't want to spend too much money on advertising it's a good place to start all right so let's go to my computer let's talk about Twitter ads and just let's get into it all right all right guys, so let's get it started. So the first thing I wanna show you is uh, one of my campaigns. So you see exactly you know, what kind of pricing we're talking about because it's really cool. You know, The pricing and everything is super cheap on Twitter if you do it right. So I wanna show you, the, that's the first thing I wanna show you. And then I'm gonna talk about you know, the type of traffic because it's really interesting because Twitter, the tra as I mentioned before, uh, the, the traffic that comes from Twitter is a little bit different. And it's from it's different from uh, Bing advertising, Google, you know, all the other traffic sources, the paid traffic sources that you might use. Uh, so you got to treat it a little bit different. It's it's not that different. It's just there's something in there that you have to do it right. And then um, obviously I'm going to do an ad in front of you. You know, I'm going to do it really quick because. There's a little bit, more, little bit more details on Twitter ads that you just kind of, you know, kind of optimize it. You have to uh, spend some time, but I'm just trying to do it as fast as possible. So I'm gonna do it quickly right in front of you. Okay. So, um, but yeah, just remember, there's, a, there's a bit more details on Twitter ads. All right. So let's get started. Let's talk about this. So the first thing I want to show you is the results. So this is one of the campaigns I wanted, I wanted to show you. It's a good example. So let me actually get in there. So as you see. This is the impression, this is today, okay? So 266 clicks, and just think and see how much I paid for the click. Seven cents per click. How crazy is that? Seven cents. So it's really, really cheap. As you see, it's just absolutely insane. So let me show you yesterday's. Um, so it actually was cheaper yesterday so it was five cents and i got 391 clicks and look at the actual results you know like the click through rate it's really really high so you see that you know when when the click through rate is that high 
you know you know that okay this is you know the ad is good the audience is good you know so as you see that's good this is good audience and getting a ton of click for such a cheap cheap um, price so this is the this is one of the things that I really really like about Twitter because it's just super cheap and the audience is just great on it. All right, so let's talk about the type of traffic. Now, this is another thing I wanted to mention was that, you know, the traffic that comes from uh, Twitter is basically cold traffic, you know. It's almost same as Facebook, okay? It's not like Google traffic or even Bing traffic because, you know, if you can really compare it to Facebook. I think that's the... It's something between Facebook and Google. It's kind of hard to explain because... Um, on Google, people are actually actively looking for stuff, right? So when your ad shows up, they're already looking for it. So uh, it's much more warmer, you know, it's like really warm. The traffic is not that cold. On the other hand, uh, Facebook is super cold. It's like cold traffic. In, if, in case if you don't know the, the words I'm using, like cold traffic and hot, hot traffic, cold is a type of traffic where you know people are not expecting and you know they're not actively looking for the product they're trying to sell so that's cold traffic so um, that's the difference you know like when pe people are looking for it you know they're interested in the product that's hot traffic you know um, so yeah that's the difference but yeah so Facebook is uh, Facebook traffic is super cold right um, people are not looking for advertising they're just trying to check out their see and see what's uh, what their friends are doing or just you know checking stuff on Facebook right that's what whatever you do when you go on Facebook um, so your ad just pops up out of nowhere so that's cold traffic now Twitter ads are somewhere in between because it's not search traffic so it's not super warm like search traffic right uh, because people are not actively looking for something but your ads on Twitter don't pop out of nowhere you know like what something you can do is you can have your ads show on uh, in hashtags you know like uh, if someone's looking for a hashtag or they're, they're just searching for something specific on related to a hashtag they see your ad so you know there's a lot of different ways that you can do Twitter ads so you see it's kind of somewhere between uh, Google and Facebook you know so just that's why the traffic is a little bit weird so the way I do it is that I send people from Twitter to a uh, pre-sale page that's the best way that's and that's the safest way really to just do it everywhere okay so in my case let me I, I'm promoting the diversity partners program by the way just to disclose this, this is my company and so basically this is an affiliate program that pays high ticket commission so you get these low ticket sales and then you know they get these easy sales and then what we do is we take your customers and we um, just you know uh, start selling high ticket products and you make those big 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 commissions like a thousand dollar all of that commissions like you know take a look so this was like a thousand four hundred fifty dollars a day a thousand dollar here eight hundred fifty seven so nothing on Sunday I believe this was Sunday and four hundred eight seventy eight and you know all that so so I've, um, you know um, I've talked about this before I think um, you should you, you can just learn more about it on diversity.com too okay so um, yeah, so let's go over and find the product. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to campaigns, okay? And um, so we have different options. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna promote this product. Now this is a YouTube product. It's super cheap, actually. Let's go back. I'm gonna test something else. So I'm gonna promote this product, okay? So let's go back. Let's go here. So what we were looking for is a pre-sale page and another cool thing when it comes to diversity partners program is that it has a lot of pre-sale pages that you can use okay so this is the pre-sale page for this product so you know it's a really good and powerful video you know it's really engaging and you know it's super awesome so people watch it they you know they want to learn more and they go and you know learn more about the product so let's get my, actually, I'm gonna get my affiliate link and I'm gonna start promoting it on Twitter, okay? So something I wanna do first of all, is I wanna create a channel here. So I know exactly where is this, uh, you know, traffic is coming from. That's very important. You, you wanna make sure we track that. Um, so let's create that. All right. So let's go back to campaigns here and let's create the link okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to add the channel 
apply perfect all right so this is gonna be my um flight link so let me just create my short link and then we're gonna be good to go we're gonna start running our ads okay all right so let's create a tracking link I don't know, I'm gonna put my link here. Doesn't matter. Twitter ad to home business bootcamp. There you go. All right, so let's add a conversion to. And this is just my part of business. Like, um, you know, I'm uh, tracking these, all of these links and everything. As an affiliate marketer, you should track. Um, every click and every cell so that's very important to do that okay so i'm gonna get this link there you go so let's go ahead and let's start an ad okay so let's do this so this is the first now the way you do you you do uh, twitter ads that you start with a tweet uh so yeah just let's put a let's put something here um i want to use the same headline or something close to this headline um all right, let me open a text file here. I'm gonna put my link here so we don't lose it. And let's go and see three easy, important steps to start profitable online business. All right. So um, I can use an image too. So I'm gonna use an image. So I'm just gonna uh, get a screenshot of this. There you go. Now another thing with Twitter, which I really like, is that the fact that they they don't have any problems with affiliate marketers, so they accept your uh, your ads most of the times, unless you're posting really sh something really shady. But um, yeah, they they accept ads like ninety nine point nine point nine nine percent of the times. It's like you know Twitter. I mean, it's like I'm um, being advertising. All right. So that's that. So this is gonna be a promoted tweet. Okay, yeah, it's gonna be promoted. Done. There you go. All right, so let's tweet it. There you go, so that's out. All right, so next step is just go ahead and create the ad, okay? So I'm gonna to go to campaigns. I'm going to uh, create a campaign and I'm gonna click on website clicks call this HBBB so one thing that this is something I mentioned before the way I budget my advertising is that let me actually put on my video so the way I budget my ads is that I usually take the amount of money I'm going to make if I make a sell with that you know if I'm if I sell that product and just use that as my daily budget so in this case the money that I'm going to make is going to be $150 because that's a $297 product so I'm going to make 150 a sell if I make the sell so I'm going to put the set my daily budget as 150 all right so yeah 150 I mean this is just me doing it you can start from really small amounts because the clicks are so cheap that you don't really have to you know spend a ton of money to get results so you can start from five dollars a day if you want okay uh, you can put a total budget too if you're interested so let's go ahead and do next now i'm gonna give this a name group one doesn't matter if that's the ad group and um that doesn't matter either bit type automatic it's fine link clicks that's fine too and you wanna you can add the conversion metric, you know, conversion key if you want, but I don't do that, so it's fine. All right, so let's um, select the tweet. There you go. So next, now this is the interesting part. This is where you select the audience. Okay, so in this case, I'm just uh, doing U.S. Uh, something I always do is I always always um, uh, target one country per campaign that's very important so for example if you want to target um, Canada in your advertising what you want to do is you want to make sure that you do a separate campaign for that country that's very important that and I always and I do that in every single platform no matter where it is you know Google YouTube uh, 
that's the same. I always make a mistake on that. Uh, uh, you know, Bing advertising, Facebook, whatever. So yeah, so just make sure you do that if you want. It just makes things much easier. Gives you more control. All right, so yeah, so that's that. And uh, what you wanna do, this is where you target your, your um, what they call them, just the keywords and basically hashtags, okay? So what you wanna do is you wanna look for keywords. In this case, because this is an affiliate marketing related product, I'm gonna put search affiliate marketing. And you know, you and this is the cool part. You can actually target lookalikes of accounts, you know, like, um, specific people on Twitter and all that stuff. So it's really cool. So affiliate marketing, we can add that. Um, and you know, it just gives you a suggestion and list of different affiliate marketing accounts. There you go, we, we can just select all of these people. So it's just, a, it's a decent audience, you know, like um, 4,000, 7,000, it's fine, right? Yeah, so we're just gonna go ahead and do this with this one and then uh, we can, kind of refine it after that, okay? Uh, actually, let's add more. I'm gonna add ClickBank to see what we get. I see it just grows the audience. So that's just, that's okay. So again, this is the part you have to spend some time to do good research, okay? So yeah, um, that's the last, the last thing you wanna do is just wanna take a look at it. Um, all right launch and it's good to go all right guys so this is how you do it you know you just gotta spend some time get the audience right and just do it just set up the campaign now as you see uh, setting up Twitter ads doesn't take that much you just have to you know spend some time you do the do that audience part right because that's the most important part of your advertising so make sure you get that right. All right guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you learned something new today. If you did, make sure to like this video, share it with your friends, and subscribe to my channel if you're not a subscriber. I'm making, a, I'm making these videos like this every single day. So, you know, if you wanna learn cool stuff every single day, you should definitely subscribe to my YouTube, YouTube channel. And also, by the way, I'm gonna leave a link in the description that's gonna take you to the gold masterclass. Now, the thing with affiliate marketing is that there are a lot of different ways that you can do affiliate marketing. And something that I, I always mention is that, you know, uh, every affiliate product and every affiliate niche has its own different strategy when it comes to selling. You know, you cannot just use the same strategy that you were using in the weight loss niche on, um, on survival niche. You know, like these are two very different niches. You need to use different strategies to sell these products. And, you know, something that we, you know, when it comes to strategies, Something that we always talk about inside Gold Masterclass, that's the link that takes you to Gold Masterclass, by the way, is that you need to know all these strategies before you actually implement them. So you need to know them, learn them, and then you need to you learn how, when you, when you choose a product, how do, what's the best strategy for that specific product. So that's something we talk about inside Gold Masterclass. So inside Gold Masterclass, you're gonna see me actually building campaigns right in front of you. This is something that no one is doing out there, you know. You're gonna see everything in detail. It's not just me telling you to do this, do that, no. You're gonna see me building campaigns right in front of you. Another thing with Gold Masterclass or Aversity in general, when you join, uh, when you join Gold Masterclass, Aversity Gold Masterclass, you become an Aversity member. Another thing that comes with the Gold Masterclass is the all-in-one system. So you have the education. Now the next thing you need after that is a good funnel and system that to help you to make money. So you know that's one of the things that I mentioned that I used. You know, if you remember, I went to my, I logged into my Aversity and Partners account. That's one of the, you know, I'm promoting the company as as an affiliate. Because, although I'm the owner, I just want to disclose that I'm the owner of the company, but I'm promoting it as the affiliate too. So you know that's the system you get when you join adversity gold masterclass too right so it's done for you system it's all the funnels all ready for you to use all you gotta just drive the traffic and that's something you learn inside gold masterclass too right so you should definitely check out the gold masterclass i'm going to leave a link in the description good stuff in there if you want to see everything in detail like you've never seen before that's definitely a place to get us started all right so thank you so much for watching this video let me know if you have any questions by leaving a comment i will see you in the next one